everybody, it's Annie Lissers here. We are in the galaxy today, floating in the stars. Where are they? There they are. I'm so excited today. I've got a new background. I wanted to kind of spice it up. And I actually went out and looked for a lava lamp. But I didn't go out. I just clicked on Amazon. Anyways, this thing popped up when it did. And I'm like, oh, man, like get, the 70s are gone, listeners. You know, come on, man. This is 2000 something. Well, I am 2000 late. Anywho, today I am going over my body mess that I got this weekend at the 575 cell. So stay tuned and let's get started on this. So I'll do a review coming up in the future on the background. But this is the Rosetta Star Projector. Like I said, I'll do a full review on it. Oh, I'll show you what it looks like. It's so cute. Oh, there you go. Oop. I'll blind you. Sorry. But it's it's a little egg. Oh, maybe I could, should turn it off. And that's a sharpest tool in the shed. They've told me that before. Anywho. <laughs> So that's what she looks like. And you can kind of just position it in the room where you kind of want it. So neat. I can sleep in the stars now. And this one does play music. Some of the cheaper ones don't. So you want it. And, and, oh, it's so cool, too. When you go to music, unfortunately, I don't know. There's so much copyrighted music. I don't know how to play my own stuff. So I have to figure that out. That's why I said it's going to take me a few, um, maybe a week or two to do a full review on it. So... And then I can change the colors on it. Because, you know, we like purple around here. You can kind of change the speed of the color changes. So, anyways, all that will come up in a future video. We're here to talk about Bath & Body Works. Now, I'm not going to ramble on any further. I got, as you can see by the thumbnail, I got four mists. I week. wasn't going to initially get vanilla mocha martini. When I went into the store, it was not on my list. But... I, and when I picked it up and smelled it, I'm like, wow, that is pretty strong. I like the it. notes for vanilla mocha martini are cozy cappuccino, vanilla orchid, and white tonka bean. Vanilla mocha martini reminded me a lot of the Midnight Amber Glow, where this has more, you have that espresso note in here. This has got that caramel bourbon kind of note, but I actually like them really paired together quite a bit. And I want to throw some pumpkin pecan waffles in there to, on the mix. <laughs> Continuing on. Next three, really in scent, I think all of these are kind of similar too. I had a raspberry vibe going on ever since Blush Cardigan. So I got Sun Blooms and Suede. I got Pastel Skies. And I got Among the Clouds. And it matches the background. Ooh, Among the Clouds. We're changing. Turn it back to purple. <laughs> anyway, I like all three of these scents. So I went ahead and picked it up. Now, a lot of people said this one's light. Well, I, it is, they're all light to me for the most part. You know, you got to continuously keep spraying it. But I really, when I heard it was light, I'm like, oh, maybe I don't want this after all. I even took him out of my cart. But when I saw him and smelled him in store, I said, oh, no, I got to have this one. So let's talk about this packaging. It's cute, although I wish they would have just taken the bottle on and then left this metal silver part up. I don't know. For me, I wish they would have done it hot pink and maybe silver in the uh, on the... We anyway. like her anyway. Her notes are wild berry skies and whip vanilla, uh, whip vanilla clouds. There you go. Yep, this is just a nice, sweet, kind of airy vanilla raspberry scent, and I am here for it all day. I will probably go in the future, I might even get the, the shower gel on that. So if I get the shower gel, then we're really doing good. So, But I love the packaging on the other stuff. I just didn't like the metal part of it, but that's just me. I'm picky like that, but what I packaging I like the best was the pastel skies. Whew. Notes are 
soft cloud berries, there's the clouds again, pink sponge sugar, and coconut musk. Yes, now I picked the musk out in this one, I remember that. So this is more muskier than this one, if that makes sense. So I like this one a lot. Matter of fact, I like just pairing up all three of these, to be real honest. And that's what I do. I love mixing my scents. Haven't tested them out so far, but I think this one so far is the one that's lasted the longest and the one I can smell the most. But I am not through thoroughly tested. It's only been a couple days, and with me, you know it takes a while. And the final one is Sun Blooms and Suede. And her notes are white raspberries, pink petals, and vanilla cream. See, I am all over trying to get that blush cardigan, and none of these got even in the ballpark. That blush cardigan, I put the lotion on and then layered this stuff over top of it. Oh, it was delicious. I would say out of the three of them, this is probably the weakest. I could have probably lived without this one. I wanted to go ahead and review all three of them. Since it was all in the same family, I'll let you know which one I think I like it best. I think it's between these two. If you're more... And, you know, this one is a bit light, so, um, but you can't smell it when you spray it on, don't, but to me, they're all light. If I spray it and then an hour later, I can't smell it anymore, so I like these two. I like them both together as well. Well, I just wanted to jump on here and just share my little myths that I got. I'm having so much fun. I said I wasn't going to collect them. Well, that was a lie. Anyway, I'm going to show you my mist uh, coming up in the next one or two videos. And uh, after that, I will start, I've got to do my body lotions and then that candle collection's coming up. I'm trying and hoping that I can do it by this weekend. At least get part one of Do Today That They Love You. Auntie listeners loves you so, so much. And we have a father that loves you even more. Until next time. We're floating off the ocean. Bye for now. Thanks so much for watching. Come back real.